great to hold for Nesson.com alongside Cam McDonough. And Cam, we're talking golf, and we want to know as we head into the 2017 PGA Tour season, who is your pick for being the golfers to watch this year? Of course, Tiger Woods is a name many people want you to say right now because they want this guy to do well. Is a Tiger Woods comeback possible? Uh, is it possible? I think so. I, you know, it, it, but it, if you're expecting him to win a, a major right away, I, I would say that probably not. You know, he's he hasn't played in a an official tournament since uh, the summer of 2015, so it's been a while. It's going to take some time. He has new clubs as well because he can't use Nike clubs anymore. So it, it's definitely going to be an adjustment period. But look, he's a guy who I think you always have to watch out for. Um, you know, he's had a lot of time off in terms of his health. As long as health is there, he's. You know, I wouldn't be surprised to see him up there and maybe some of the non-major tournaments and maybe even be a factor in winning one. Jay is the world's number one golfer. How long do you think he can hold on to that? Well, the thing about Jason Day is, you know, he had an incredible uh, ending to the season prior to last year and a, a great start to it. But the ending, he sort of fizzled out and he uh, withdrew from his last uh, two tournaments in the FedEx Cup. So he's sort of on a downward uh, trend here. Uh, so he's he's a name that I would not be surprised to see him uh, be overtaken by someone in the uh, world golf rankings unless. He shows us something uh, here different than what he's been doing. 2016 was a fantastic year for Dustin Johnson. He was the PGA Tour Player of the Year. Who do you think comes to that name, that title this year? Yeah, you know, I think um, uh, Dustin Johnson's a name you still got to look out for. I mean, this is a guy who the uh, the question for him was always because he always, you know, he could hit the ball a mile, uh, you know, and he had just such incredible talent. He won tournaments that weren't majors. It was a question of could he win in a major. Now that he finally has, you know, I think the sky's the limit for this guy, and he's a name who you could definitely see out there. I mean, I'd say the early. Uh, early name you got to look out for is actually sort of a, an under-the-radar name in terms of uh, Justin Thomas, who's uh, won three tournaments already this season, and he had a, a 59 in one of those tournaments as well. Maybe to call him the player of the year might be a little bit of a stretch, but he's definitely a name to watch out for this year. Okay, well, we'll be following along closely, and in New England, if you can't play golf, at least you can follow along at Nesson.com.